read for you today, Kiss Goodnight by Amy Heist. It was a dark and stormy night on Plum Street. In the little white house, Miss Bear was putting Sam to bed. Ready now, Sam? Oh no, said Sam. I am waiting. Miss Bear sat on the bed beside Sam and they read his favorite book and they both knew all the words. Afterward, Miss Bear pulled one side of the blanket way up high under Sam's chin and the blanket, blanket was red. She pulled the other side too, tucking it under his toes like a nest. Outside the wind blew. Hoo, hoo. Ready now, Sam? Oh no, said Sam. I'm waiting. Miss Bear arranged Sam's friends in the bed and they all snuggled close in the blanket. That was red. Outside, the rain came down, splat on the roof, splat, splat on the windows. The wind blew. Hoo, hoo. Ready now, Sam? Oh no, said Sam. I'm waiting. Miss Bear poured milk in two glasses and they both drank milk and it was warm, sliding down. Afterward, Miss Brown Bear yawned. You must be ready now, she said, but Sam shook his head. I am waiting. Hmm, said Miss Bear. Let me think. We've read a book and made a nest. Arrange your friends and had warm milk. Sam, she said. What did I forget? You know, said Sam. Hmm, said Miss Bear. Book, blanket, friends, milk. Book, blanket, friends, milk. Sam waited. He waited and waited. And then at last, Miss Bear said, Oh, I know. Kiss goodnight, Sam. And she bent way down, kissing Sam once and twice and then twice more. Again, cried Sam. And she bent way down, kissing Sam once and twice and then twice more. Outside, the wind blew and the rain came down. In the little white house, Miss Bear was taking out the light, whispering, Good night, kiss good night, Sam, kiss good night. And Sam went to sleep on a dark and stormy night on Plum Street. The end.